Hey guys, welcome to Tony's How To's. In this video, I will show you how to download Gamma Presentation. So if you're wondering how can you actually download your Gamma Presentation when you, once you actually generated your presentation. As you can see right now, I have this presenta presentation about AI. So the, by default, when you look at the, the uh, UI here for Gamma, you won't see the option to directly download that into your computer but the download button is actually just hidden. So you just need to follow the steps that I'll be showing you. So here at the top right of the screen, you will see your profile icon or your profile menu. So next there, you'll see the tree dotted icon. You just need to click on that. And from here, you'll be able to see the export button. So just click on export. Now in here, you have two options to download your presentation. You could either have this on PDF or in PowerPoint. So it's also going to give you some points here, which is the following fonts might be required for you to install on your PC in order for these fonts to actually work on your, uh, in order for your presentation to actually work on your PC. So if you don't, if you're not aware how to actually download these fonts, the only thing you need to do here is you just need to click on that font. It's going to open up fonts.google.com. And from here, you need to click on download font family. And it's going to download automatically and you need to open that up. And once you open that up, the only thing that you need to do here is you need to run this one. So what you're going to run this one is the .ttf file here. So from here, just double click on .ttf and here just click on install and wait for it to install. Now once done, you need to click on next and just click on exit once the installation button is actually grayed out and you want to open the other .ttf file here and basically install it again. And once it complete install, just click on X and you've just successfully installed your font here. Now, the only thing that you need to do here is basically just start downloading your presentation. So for this example, we want to download this as PDF, but you also have the option to download this as PowerPoint. So make sure that you have a few minutes to wait before you be able to receive your PowerPoint presentation. But for this video, let's just click on export to PDF. Now here it's going to say generating PDF. Again, we need to wait for a bit before we could actually use our PDF. So let's just wait for this one. And as you can see, it's going to say your PDF is ready. So in here at the top right of your screen, you'll see a download button. Just click on that and you'll be able to see your PDF. Now, if you want to know the location of your PDF file, just click on the folder icon. Now here it's going to pop up here and we just want to click on PDF and you'll be able to view your PDF presentation here. And that's about it. So thank you for watching. If you have any questions, feel free to ask in the comment section. If you enjoyed this video and found it helpful, you could use the link in the description to subscribe. See you in the next video.